Hey everyone, this is Judy with JLB Crafts. Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, thank you so much for giving me a try. Today I'm going to be setting up the monthly view in my social media planner. Um, mostly what I track on these pages is a little bit of overall beginning to end month um, stat information, analytics, but mostly I write in whatever video is going to post on every day. It helps me plan my video posting schedule. So uh, I do need, uh, I can put a little deco on the, on the boxes, but I need enough space to write in my videos. So with all that being said, I want to go, I want to embrace the flowers on the pages. I usually cover those up, but since with the saying, April showers bring May flowers. May is my big month. I like to keep the florals, so we're not going to cover them up. But since they're black and white, I thought I would pair them with the new black and white sticker book, which I haven't really used to do a spread yet. I mean, I pulled a sticker out here and there, but I haven't actually used it, used it. So um, let's go ahead and get started. I want to put something in the six boxes up here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and cover notes. And then I'm going to include some some stat box stuff, so it should be shouldn't be too complex. So I'm just looking for long, thin quotes. I like this "Stay Present." Let's see where we can fit it. I'm thinking maybe here. I want the biggest, boldest quote on this side because it's got to represent the whole page for the most part. Like I could put other stuff over here for this side, but I want this to be a nice big bold quote. So yeah, there we go. All right. Now oh, that t fills that space nicely. Now let's look for something for over here. There is beauty and kindness. That's a tad small for those three boxes. Let's see what else we can find. Look how wonderfully you've grown. That's kind of fitting since I was able to monetize this last month. Um, which was a big goal, hitting a thousand subscribers. That might be the one we end up going with because I think most of the big quote pages, I, I could combine it with something like this. Yeah, I think that's gonna be the key. Because uh, I'm not really seeing anything else that's gonna fill that space. So I like that, let's do that one. And these are too wide, really, to go in the sidebar, so... Um, let's look for... Okay, so I want to put some stat boxes. I think I want to go ahead and put them down here. And I saw... Yes, these, I think, I want to use. So... Do I want gold? I don't really have gold foil anywhere else. But it does kind of draw attention since they're going to be snugged up in the corner down here. So yeah, let's go ahead and do gold. And I basically need about two sets of three and a single. So I'm just gonna stagger them a little bit. And then we'll break it up with a gold one. Yeah, that's cute. I like the way that looks. And then we'll do another set of three. So those are just for some statistics beginning and the end of the month and then the change. Not a lot of decoration on this one. This is mo this monthly view is mostly functional. Okay, so there's that. That's a lot of little boxes. Let's go ahead and put some stuff up in here. I'm thinking oh, I want a paper, a rectangular paper box to cover notes. Just be you. I like that. And then some kind of long thin maybe. New month, fresh start. Make big plans. I like this one. Small steps lead to big results. It's easy to compare yourself to someone else who's growing faster or getting better results. or But slow and steady wins the race, right? So I like that one. Honestly, I think that might be about it. I mean, I could put a few little small words in there. What book? What book did I use last month? Guys, can you talk to me? What book did I use last month that had all the little black and white words in it? It was the purple book. Girl with goals. So I don't really want purple, but 
didn't this oh and this is i will link this video the video for this in the um cards up above but basically i combined the 30 page value pack sticker book with the um accessory pack so i've got all my little post-it notes right here in the back and then i've got 20 pages from that and the 30 pages from the book and i've got it all in one great big book so I have it all together in one shot and I used, um, instead of just tape runner, I used contact cement, which is a little bit laborious. You got to paint it on both surfaces, let it sit for 15 minutes and then stick the surfaces together and it makes a permanent bond, which is great because this sucker isn't falling apart. It's really holding together well. So anyway, this is what I wanted. Um, I want to just grab some of these words. I love this. Look how far you've come. Just caught my eye. I want that one. There's room to add a few words. You're doing great. I just want to grab a few of these to stick on there. Good times ahead. Here's a little OMG. I like that. Uh, look how wonderfully... Look how you have wonderfully grown. That's a little bit awkward, the wording, but you did it. Yes, girl. You do you. I just love these. I could, I could use all of these. <laughs> Trust the journey. I like plans or dreams in the making. Working hard. I'm going to put over here because I don't want it on the weekend. One more for right there. Crushed it. Might as well finish out that little sip bunch. Um, I know it's pretty barren and um, sterile, just all black and white, but I like it. It's functional. It's, it will have some color on it because I, if you guys haven't figured out my YouTube channel, um, the thumbnails are color coded. So red is always lettering, hand lettering practice. Purple is always dashboard. Green is always vertical. So if you didn't know that, yellows are recipes. Um, I also use a highlighter to highlight um, on this view as well so that I can at a glance see, oh man, I have no yellow. I haven't done a single recipe this month. Where can we squeeze a recipe and that kind of thing. So anyway, um, let's go ahead also and do my wellness and fitness planner monthly view. Okay, so this is the monthly view for my wellness and fitness planner, which I like to keep um, nice and soft and lots of florals and serene, nothing super bright and jarring. So for this one, I want to use the pressed florals um, sticker book, which again is a combination of the value pack sticker, 30 sheet value pack sticker book and the um, uh, accessory book. Same exact process as with the other book I just showed you. And for this monthly view, all I write on this monthly view is symptoms. So if you have a chronic medical condition or somebody in your family has a chronic, me chronic medical condition or um, just odd symptoms, you know, the first thing the doctor always asks you is, well, when did that start? So I use this view for symptoms and some months I write almost nothing on it and some months I write a lot on it. So anyway, um, I, I want to try to fit this darling, you're different. I think I can fit it there. I just need to cover up, jot it down. So let's white that out. Normally I like to try to cover that with a paper sticker, but I just really like that super bright. It's just feels springy to me almost a rainbow sticker. I want to try to fit that in there. So let's start with that without covering too much, too many numbers or the days of the week. I'm not going to sweat it too much if I cover a little bit because obviously I know what order the days of the week go in. So, and I don't need tons of room on this monthly view. I like it. Okay, and then there's some super skinny washi strips on this in this book. I want to co cover this orange with. Um, it's not that I don't like the orange. I just, it doesn't really match this color scheme. So normally I use, here we go. Normally I use washi tape. 
think I'm gonna need, yeah, let's grab one of the super longest ones. These are so incredibly thin. Hopefully, I, I don't even know actually, now that I'm looking at it, if it's gonna be, oh yeah, it's just exactly the same width. I wasn't sure it would be wide enough to actually cover that line. This was my um, Mother's Day spread for my wellness planner for next week. I'll hang on to this and grab, yeah, that one's gonna be just long enough. So I'm gonna put this back in here, as straight as I can, there we go. And we'll grab this one. Awesome, perfect, I like it. There we go. Okay, um, let's try to find something for over here. And I'm actually thinking maybe I want to try to find a really pale paper flower sticker to sneak under this um, first letter to help hide that white out a little bit better. I know there are tons of pressed florals in here. So I could actually grab maybe this white one. Yeah, let's grab one of these. I'm going to grab my palette knife to try to peel that sticker up. Could I live with it? Yes. Can I make it better? Also yes. Yeah, way better. There we go. Okay. So I also um, don't mind like if I'm having a rough day uh, putting in some space for give yourself a pep talk. I did that a couple months ago for the first time and I actually really enjoyed it. So this live simply is kind of nice for over here. It has the same rainbow, but a little more subtly with the gold. I could also do this live today. No, that's too tall. Those are nice. We'll come back and get some of those. Just like I did on the last spread, we'll sprinkle those around. Just bloom, choose joy. Chase the sunset. Now that it's spring and um, I don't know if that's, that line though mimics too closely. Maybe believe you can. Will that fit? Yes, I like that. Wants to believe you can. Not too matchy matchy. I like it. Okay. Stuff for over here. I would like to do, I think, an empty box of some sort to give myself a pep talk, if you will. And I think all the boxes in here might be like to-do kind of boxes today. Priorities. Noted. I'm just looking for something I could put in here that kind of implies, a, you know, a, a space for writing down some encouraging words to myself on a day that's not maybe going the greatest. <laughs> I found that, see these all say to do, very functional. All right, so I think what I'll plan on doing is quote, quote, and note to self kind of space. And I'm gonna have to pull a different book for that. So I'm gonna grab one of the wellness books that has those kinds of spaces in it. And we'll see what we can find to match the color scheme. Okay, so I pulled this wellness book um, because I thought these little mason jars would look cute with all the florals. And it says practice gratitude, which isn't give yourself a pep talk. But I do find that when you're having a lot of negative thoughts, if you're beating yourself up, um, if you try to get yourself to switch your focus to the positive things in your life, um, it can help ease, ease a little bit. Um, so I want to pick a couple of these that have flowers so that when I put the mason jar in between, it, it makes sense, right? So... Seek beauty in all things. I want to feel as free as the flowers. Choose joy. I'm kind of leaning toward one of these two. Um, I want thinking though, do those blues kind of match too close? Maybe, maybe purple because this doesn't really have any purple in it. Let's put purple. Okay, so I'm gonna put this right down here. Just kind of evenly in the space. Okay, and then if I put a mason jar here, that kind of leaves me room for maybe a square-ish. One more square sticker, choose happy. So I could put the mason jar in between this one and this one. That's kind of cute. 
let's do that. And it even has a little pair of scissors for cutting the flowers that you're going to hopefully put in your mason jar. So again, let's just center this. This looks a little big. It is. I think what I want to do is try to slide it underneath. So let's lift these up. I think you can still tell it's a mason jar, right? There we go. Yep, that'll work. Okay, then the only thing I have left then is going back and getting a few of those little words to put around. So let's just put a few of these around. Feed your soul. I'm just going to go kind of through all the different uh, colors. Enjoy the now. Just little words that strike me, speak to me. Choose joy. Live more. So I'm just, I'm looking forward to where I would put one down here. And I think I'm going to put one here, so I don't want to put one right above it. So go like that. Rest and relax. I like that. And come over here. Put it kind of over the weekend. Well, this is perfect. I got, um, got two, two more. Free spirit. Crooked, crooked, crooked. Life is lovely. All right, so lots of color, lots of interesting, encouraging words to catch my attention, but still plenty of functional space for what I need this for. So let's put it in my planner. There we go. There is my monthly view for May in my health and wellness planner. I hope you like this video. I hope it encourages you to use more of the monthly views in your planners if you rock uh, multiple planners like I do. Don't put too much pressure on to use them and fill them all up. Just enjoy them and make them useful to you. I hope you like this video. If you did, please consider liking and subscribing. Thank you.